Sibelius 7 makes creating scores fast, easy, and fun. Featuring a brand new task-orientated user interface, an incredible new professional quality sound library with exclusive sounds you won't hear anywhere else, full music XML import and export support, powerful new text and graphics features and more besides, Sibelius 7 represents another giant leap for music notation software. The toolbar and menus from previous versions of Sibelius have been replaced with a wide band of command buttons that runs across the top of the window, called the ribbon. Every feature of the program has been organised into 10 tabs, plus the special file tab, that are ordered from left to right in roughly the order in which you perform tasks to create your score. For an overview of the interface changes in Sibelius 7, watch the separate Sibelius 7 guided tour video. The File tab contains options that used to be in the File menu, such as opening, saving and appending scores, plus exporting into other formats, and the Help menu, such as accessing documentation, registering Sibelius, and so on. The Score Info dialog is now found on the Info page in the File tab, and usefully allows you to switch between showing the info for each dynamic part. Click the thumbnail on the right, or any of the other ribbon tabs, to return to the score. From the recent page, you can see the complete path to each score you've been working on. Plus you can pin a score so that it always appears at the top of the list, very useful for ongoing projects. Sibelius 7 includes a new print preview, which shows you exactly what will be printed out. Check that your booklets or spreads will print as you expect, and see the effect of options like borders, crop marks, and so on directly on the preview. Printing on both sides of the paper is now easier. Sibelius tells you when you need to flip the paper over and feed it back into your printer. All of the options for exporting your score into different formats are found on the export page. You can now export your score as a music XML file without requiring any separate plugins. Export is fast and gives better results than existing solutions. You can choose whether to export as uncompressed or compressed music XML, ready for importing into your other music programs. You can also export your score and parts directly to PDF. You no longer require a separate PDF printer driver on Windows. Now it's as simple as making the choice between exporting only the score or only the parts, either as separate files or in a consolidated file containing all the parts, or even both together. Simply point and click and you have publication quality PDFs ready to share or print. From the teaching page, you can access classroom control, launch the worksheet creator, or add your current score to the worksheet creator as a worksheet or a template. The help page includes options that used to be in the help menu in previous versions. Come here to access on-screen documentation, check for updates, go online for support, or change program preferences. The other tabs of the ribbon contain the features from the other menus in previous versions of Sibelius. The Home tab contains features from the Edit and Create menus. The Note Input tab contains features from the Edit and Notes menus. The Notations and Text tabs contain features from the Create menu, and so on. For a general tour of the ribbon, watch the Sibelius 7 guided tour video. Sibelius 7 is a fully 64-bit application, which means it can take advantage of all the memory you have installed in your computer. To show off these new capabilities, we've included an exclusive professional quality sound library called Sibelius 7 Sounds. With a specially recorded symphony orchestra, exciting rock, pop and jazz sounds, plus a 27-stop pipe organ from Hauptwerk, and marching brass and percussion sounds from Sample Logic, Rumble and Fanfare, featuring multi-time world champion drum corps, the Blue Devils, Sibelius 7 Sounds raises the bar for sounds in notation software. Listen to how good it sounds.
you can control playback through the redesigned mixer. With vertical faders like a real mixing desk, the mixer can be docked at the bottom of the screen and resized between four different heights, showing progressively more controls using this button. Text has been given a huge overhaul in Sibelius 7, with a brand new engine that not only looks more precise on the screen at any zoom level, but also adds advanced typography features familiar from desktop publishing software. Click and drag to create a text frame with automatic word wrapping, and specify the alignment of the text using these buttons on the text tab, including fully justified text. Open the new inspector by typing Ctrl Shift I, Shift Command I on Mac to see the new advanced options for changing text appearance. Increase tracking, leading, character scaling, set text to be subscript or superscript, change its background color, even rotate it by any angle. The inspector replaces the properties window from previous versions of Sibelius. It is designed to be summoned when you need it and hidden when you don't. Unlike the properties window, it only shows you options that are relevant to the current selection. It is also fully keyboard accessible, so you can simply show it, make your changes and hit return to hide it again. You can pin the inspector so that it is always on the screen, in which case typing its shortcut puts focus in it so you can type new values. Notice that the status bar at the bottom of the window gives you many different kinds of information about your score, some of which used to appear in the old properties window. Now it's always available at a glance without an extra window cluttering up your screen. Importing graphics into Sibelius 7 is easier than ever before. Most standard formats are now supported directly, including TIFF, PNG, JPEG, GIF, and the web's standard vector graphic format, SVG. Import graphics simply by dragging and dropping, and resize, scale, and crop the graphic using the improved graphics frame. You can even rotate the graphic by dragging the handle in the middle. Hold Shift to snap to the points of the compass. From the Notations tab of the ribbon, you can also flip the graphic horizontally or vertically, and adjust its colour and opacity. You can even use any graphic as a symbol, which opens up a world of possibilities for graphic notations. For publishing use, you can specify that the graphic should be linked to an external file, so that when the external file changes, the graphic in the score automatically updates too. The ribbon is designed to make exploration and experimentation easier. You'll probably discover features that you never knew were there. To aid your discovery, there are buttons to access useful plugins more directly than hunting through the old plugins menu. Here on the Home tab, there are new buttons for the Split Bar and Join Bars plugins. And on the Note Input tab, there's a button for a new version of the Renotate Performance plugin for cleaning up after FlexiTime and MIDI import, which now handles multiple voices, tuplets, grace notes, and arpeggios. Explode and Reduce also get their own buttons, making these common arranging tasks easier than ever, and students and composers will find inspiration in the Transformations plugins. Other plugins appear both as individual buttons and in the plugins galleries on several ribbon tabs. Any plugins you install yourself into custom named folders appear here on the Home tab. Don't forget to watch the Sibelius 7 guided tour video for an overview of how to work with the new interface. For more details on all of the new features in Sibelius 7, and to access detailed documentation, go to the Help page in the File tab and click What's New.